Earlier this year, Belgian racer Jackie X was honoured at the inaugural historic Motorsport International Gala event in London. The 72-year-old has long been recognised as one of the greats, and like many of his era, he raced everything from motorbikes to touring cars, and from endurance racing to Formula One. Everyone is surprised when I say what I wanted to be in my childhood. I always thought I would have loved to be a gardener or to be a gamekeeper. I did motor racing basically because I was poor at school. But when I started racing with motorcycle, for the first time in my life, I discovered that uh, the joy of the podium. And that changed a lot of things in life when you know you're at least good at one thing. But he wasn't only good on a bike, he was fast in a car too. And it was Ken Tyrrell who gave the young X his big break in single seaters, racing alongside some of the biggest names in motorsport. In my childhood, when I was not uh, planning to become race driver at all, uh, Fangio was the iconic driver and he still is. More contemporary to me, uh, Jim Clark was the uh, total inspiration and um, clearly the chance to be a partner in the uh, Cantero team with Jackie Stewart was quite something because he was an inspiration to beat. He has always been the man with 100 Grand Prix, three uh, title of world champion and we were next to each other so it was a privilege. Ix didn't secure a world title himself. In more than a decade of Grand Prix, he won eight races and made the podium 25 times. But by the mid-70s, sports cars and Le Mans were at the forefront of the Belgians' thoughts. Motorsport was very, very dangerous in those days. It's not a matter of talent, it's a matter of luck, pure luck. I did a huge mileage of motor racing. I didn't hurt myself, but at a certain moment, honestly, I've realized that I was not ready anymore to, to pick up the last two tenths of second need to win a Grand Prix. So the incredible offer to join Porsche was really welcome. I've driven almost all the Porsche possible, 935, 936, 956, even Paris-Dakar with a, a 911. When you drive a Porsche, it's clearly an open door for winning. When X began his association with Porsche, he'd already won the 24 Hours of Le Mans twice. But his new partnership ensured his legend, as he went on to win a total of six races at the Circuit de la Sarthe. Le Mans is like playing at the casino the same number six times in a row. You need to be lucky and to be in the right car and to have the right partner. To win one time Le Mans, it's an iconic win. When you have won two times, three times, four times, it becomes incredible. Tom Christensen, who is a very excellent driver, he won nine times. Can you imagine what it is nine times? That will be unbeatable. While Ix dominated his own era at Le Mans, the Grand Prix victories, Can-Am title and even victory in the Dakar rally proved his versatility. He may tell us that he was lucky, but it was his winning attitude that made him such a fierce competitor and a legend of motorsport. Never give up. Even if you are far down in the position uh, during the race, even if you're last sometimes, you can win. You are surrounded by uh, great co-drivers, great engineers. Sometimes there are races you shouldn't win and you win, but you have always to believe in it.